Hello friends, I am S.K. Sharma and in this video I am again uh, be telling you about uh, a very important chapter on statistics and uh, this video uh, you know is useful uh, for students of right from class 6, 7 to 12 BCom, BA, MCom, CA you know for all the classes it's a common topic and uh, kindly watch the video till the end because I am going to tell you about the three different types of bar diagrams Okay, the first is simple bar diagram, then I will be telling you about how to draw multiple bar diagrams and then uh, subdivided multiple bar diagrams, right? So let's take uh, a little sa different type of simple bar diagram, where you have know, minus mein agar, uh, frequency, if you minus it, how do you plot it? Fine? So, as you have given that industries are given and profit and loss is given in the question as you can see agriculture there is a profit of 30 crores mining profit of 50 crores oil there is a loss of 20 crores textile there is a loss of 10 crores and service there is a profit of 40 crores so let's see how to draw a simple bar diagram using these figures fine so again like uh, you know for this Okay, so again like you can take this as the industries and this is profit or loss. So profit and loss and these are taken as industries. Fine. So as you can see here that uh, you know there is a gap, the gaps are of 10. So you can take this as uh, you know 10, 20, 30. 40 and 50 one more you can take this is zero okay so let's start with agriculture now uh, as you can see here that agriculture is 30 30 crores there is a profit of and equally mark all these points here right so this is agriculture a G R in short okay agriculture is 30 so that means the lines this is the bar for agriculture right 30 then mining is 50 so you can take this as mining mining here So this is mining plus there is a profit of 50 crores and in oil you know you have a, a loss of 20 crores so that is my question how to plot this for this you can extend this line like this this is zero point of origin and you can take this as minus 10 this is minus 20 and minus 30 make sure that you have equal gaps Okay, oil is minus 20, so oil is here and this is minus 20, so okay, so this is oil minus 20 loss and again textile you have a loss of uh, 10 crores, so 10 minus 10, so plot this, something like this, so this is minus 20 crores, this is minus 10 crores, one more is there. And that is service so you have to extend the line a little bit make sure that you have uniform gaps in between the bars okay service sector is 40 so 40 is uh, somewhere here okay, so this is 40 agriculture was 30 crores profit and this is 50 so like this again you can uh, shade this graphs okay so your diagram will be like this right how to draw multiple bar diagrams very important for your examination so kindly watch this with full attention okay now there is a change in the question because along with vehicles and ears you are also given the production like in this question 
there are three years given that is uh, 2000 2010 and 2020 and car bike cycle auto these are the vehicles manufactured like in 2000 cars 150 250 500 so like that okay so let's see how to draw a multiple bar diagrams using these three variables okay so for that So you have to extend a bit. Okay. Now see this. You can take this as a production. As you can see, the smallest figure is 100, and there is a gap of 50, and the maximum figure is uh, 1000. So you can take gaps of. This is 100, 200, 300, 300. This is 400. Make sure that uh, you have equal gaps. 600. 700, 800, two more to go, that is 900, and more, that is 1000. Okay, and here you can take, you know, years. This is 0. So again, uh, this is, uh, you can take this as uh, 2000, right? And uh, little bit, okay, fine. So let's start with 2000. See cars. In 2000, it is 150. So 150 is somewhere between 100 and this thing. So this is about car. Okay, this is car. 150 like that. Uh, bike, bike is 100. So you can plot this here. This is bike. Like that. Cycle is 300. So that means. This is 300, so all these bars, you know, they should be of equal width. And this is cycle. Like that, auto rickshaws are 500. So again, you have to take right from 500. The width should be the same. And this is auto. Okay, so this is how you have to draw and this is of 2000. Like that, when we consider 2010, so you can start from here. Okay, make sure that you have equal gaps. Again, in 2010, car, 250 cars were manufactured. Uh, 200 or 300 ke beach mein 250. So, this is car. So like that, bike, is 300 so this is thoda sa aur aapko upar karna hai this is bike like that uh, cycle is 150 so again 200 and this is cycle okay then after 600 autos to aapko yahan se start karna hai So this is you know auto and which year was this? This is 2010. So like this, like that. 2020 में देखते cars the same gap should be there. Okay, uh, cars were manufactured 500. So you know आपको यहाँ से start करना है. So this is again car. Uh, bike is 1000. This column is the biggest And maybe yeah, you know, my board is going to go up. Or also up. Right? So. Okay. Like that. So this is bike. Again, uh, cycle is 100. 100 so this is here this is c y c l e cycle and auto rickshaws 800 this can be column both and 800 is somewhere here okay so this is auto so like this you know 
इसको हम लोग अलग अलग तरीके से शेड भी कर सकते हैं कलर से टू मेक इट मोर अट्रैक्टिव एंड दिस इज नॉट ओके फ्रेंड्स देखते हैं थर्ड टाइप ऑफ बार डायग्राम एंड दिस इज सब डिवाइडेड बार डायग्राम Now, ऐसा टाइप का बार डायग्राम हम लोगों ने यू नो स्कूल लेवल में या कॉलेज लेवल में आई डोंट थिंक आप लोगों ने किया हुआ है सो ए न्यू टाइप ऑफ बार डायग्राम हम देखते हैं इसको क्लिप बनाएंगे कैसे सबसे पहले आपको क्वेश्चन को समझना है जैसे कि यहाँ पे क्वेश्चन में फ्रेंड्स दिया हुआ है ये नंबर ऑफ इयर्स दिया हुआ है टू थाउजेंड सिक्सटीन सेवनटीन एटीन नाइनटीन एंड यहाँ पे चार मेट्रो सिटीज इंडिया की डेली मुंबई कोलकाता चेन्नई and that is given and number of accidents are given in these cities theek hai to ye char four years mein like the number of accidents that has happened in mumbai delhi kolkata chennai so that is given so let's see how to draw a sub divided bar diagram using these figures again as usual you know right and uh, again mark the points fine like that you can also mark this these points and make sure that the, all these are in equal intervals right now when you plot this first of all go to this total figure okay this figure Like uh, in 2016, you can mark this as 2016. This is 2017. This is 2018, and uh, this is for 2019. So four years are here, and uh, this is number of accidents. You can write it here years, and on the y-axis, number of You no know, accidents, right? So now plot this figures first. Total figure ko apko pehle plot karna hai. Like uh, in 2016, it is 150. So you can mark this first. Uh, even like uh, you can take uh, 100, 100 and uh, 200. What is the largest figure? 400. So you can mark this as uh, 150. 200, 250, 300, and one more that is 400. So like this, यहाँ पे सबसे छोटा नंबर 150 है और सबसे बड़ा 400 है, तो यहाँ पे प्लॉट करने में कोई दिक्कत नहीं आएगी. Let's see 2016 में total number of accidents in these four cities is 150. So 150 is here. So draw a bar diagram for this. Right. Again, in 2017 it is 200. So 2017. You must ensure that the width of the bars should be similar. Then in 2018, 300. So 300 is here. So you know most probably here. So this is three hundred, like that. In two thousand nineteen, it is four hundred. So four hundred have to go the topmost. Okay. So there we are with the total columns. Now, again, now you know each column is subdivided. That's why its name is subdivided bar diagram. Like you know one fifty. Now 150 in 2016. When we think about 2016, again 150 is divided into 60, 50, 30, 10. 10. Okay, so that means you know you have to divide this into four parts, and uh, let's say this is uh, 60. Okay, so this is 60, and uh, the rest one is uh, little bit you know you have to take smaller one, and then we have uh, 50. This is fifty, and then we have this is thirty, and this is ten. So that means you have to divide this one fifty again into four parts, and that is sixty, fifty, thirty, ten. So this is subdivided like that. In two thousand seventeen, the first part ninety, 
90, 50, 40 and 20. So, you know 90, uh, you can take this somewhere here. So, this is 90 and then uh, we have uh, 50. So, 50 will be somewhere here. This is 50 and then 40 and then 20. So, like this. Again, like 300, this is the total figure is 300. So, like it is has to be subdivided into 120, 70, 60 and 50. So, 120 most probably, you know, it will be somewhere here. 120. Then we have uh, 70. So, 70 maybe here. Then we have uh, 60 and 50. So, like that. So like you know when you draw this with the help of a scale ruler so that will be more accurate like that in 2019 we have 150 180 70 the total figure is uh, 400 so like you can divide this you know 150 150 is somewhere here so this is 150 and uh, 100 so 100 will be somewhere here this is 150, this is 100, then we have uh, 80 and 70. So I think this will be somewhere here and this is 100, this is 80 and this is 70. So like that. So we have to divide each bar into again, you know, uh, into uh, many divisions and uh, according to question you just have to place them. So friends, uh, that's all in this video and I hope uh, you have a lot of information about the bar diagram here. Do practice these questions and uh, see you in the next video. Till then, goodbye. Take care.